Hello, it's Peter. And today we're gonna to be doing an installation of a new product we're trying out. It's called the Garbage Commander, and it's useful for uh, long driveways if you need to get your barrels down to the street. The main components of the kit, you'll receive a receiver base, an adjustable upright with swivel tab, 12 inch support arms, two mountain hooks, and two retainer brackets. You'll also receive a total of six quarter inch by three quarter inch bolts, nuts, and lock washers, one three eighths inch by one inch bolt, washer, and lock nut, and two two inch PTO clips. Step one, you're going to be bolting the adjustable upright to the receiver base. At this point, you're choosing the operational height for your garbage commander. We suggest a height between 14 inches to 21 inches, allowing for approximately 30% of the can's weight to be resting on the support arm. Step two, take the assembled upright and receiver base and attach the support arm. For this step, you're going to be tightening it snug with the washer in between the two so that it's not loose but can still pivot. You want the support arm to be able to swivel on the base but not wobble. Step three. Mount the two mountain hooks and two retainer brackets to each side of the 12 inch support arm. There are two hook settings. The outer holes are 12 inch and the inside holes will be nine inches. And finally, install the re quick release pins. We recommend when transporting your wheeled cans on steep or challenging grades to secure it using all the clips that come standard with your order. The spring clip can be bent outward to make fastening easier. The installation instructions come with a few warnings. Keep all nuts tightened. Do not exceed 15 miles per hour or 75 pounds in your garbage cans. Do not carry passengers. Do not use on public roads. Turn off the vehicle and put it in park before attaching your garbage hook. Garbage hooks are designed for towing. Do not back up with the cans attached. Damage may occur. Once your garbage commander assembly is fully assembled, the last step will be to insert it into your hitch and secure it with the hardware that comes with your hitch. Remember to follow us on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram at Dean Team Golf Carts, and follow us on Twitter at DTGC Parts. 